All of that is still coming up, but first, the Nickel has a new exhibition opening up this Thursday, and it's all about diversity. Joining us now at the preview is Joyce Sledge, Josie Rechtenwald, and Trish Dressen. Thank you, beautiful ladies, for being here today. Thank you. I love it. All three of you beautiful ladies have brought some really beautiful art. So, Trish, tell us how excited you are for this new exhibit. <laughs> Um, these beautiful ladies know how excited I am, but um, what happened is about a year and a half ago, uh, we went before our exhibition and programming committee and we presented Juji Morales. Her artwork has won a Caldecott uh, for her various books and we were just so excited to bring her art to life in our gallery and build an exhibition worthy of her life work. Uh, of course she passed with flying colors. Again, our mission is to exhibit, tour, collect, and preserve the finest art from children's illustrated literature and Juji certainly has proved that she is has the finest arts. And so ladies, tell us um, what your plans are for this exhibit and how you're really helping bring it to life. All right, well, Juji's work is a celebration of what she does love. And part of the things that she loves are her home country of Mexico, the Spanish language, colorful storytelling, and of course, rich family traditions. And so in co collaboration with one another, we are um, bringing some of the community members uh, in on Thursday from 5 to 8 at the Nickel, we will have presentations and demonstrations that depict uh, you, you, what Juji mm -hmm. loves and also uh, multicultural literature to connect it with. And so Joyce, I know your family, um, both of you ladies, are really big in bringing your culture to the rest of yes. the big country. How excited are you to um, offer this and to be a part of it? I'm extremely excited. Juji Morales is an amazing author and illustrator. Um, our children grew up and we know a lot of our friends and family who love her. And so just adding some more culture and things that we grow up with, things that Juji and her lifestyle and her journey grew up with and making that real to people is going to be amazing. It's uh, really exciting for the nickel because this mm -hmm. is actually really our first time to partner with um, a, a group, an entity to ensure that uh, we always celebrate the art, the finest art from children's picture books, and it's displayed in our gallery space every day, free of charge. Mm -hmm. And Saturdays we have free art activities from one to four, so please come. But we're actually building programming based on the content in the books. And without these beautiful ladies, who if you can't tell them apart, I can. I'll give you Identical my tell. Identical twins. I'll give you my <laughs> tell like after you. the show. Um, it's, so it's really exciting because it truly becomes a community endeavor, not only for exposure to beautiful, fine art, but then also an educational opportunity for people not only within this community, but this show will travel for up to three years across the United States. And in my opinion, I do think this will be an international show that will go to other countries as well. All right, so ladies, what time on Thursday is all of this taking place? It starts at 5 o'clock. They're at the nickel and it goes to 8 o'clock, 8 p.m. during Art Walk. So you guys are already down there, come on in. Um, the doors are open and welcome. It's gonna be colorful, it's gonna be beautiful, it's gonna be a lot of stuff going on. And we can't end this interview without talking about her books. I mean, let's, yes. let's, let's talk about the, the titles of them and kind of the art that goes with it. All right, this is one that will be showcased also. This is called Dreamers. And this actually uh, shares the story of Juji's, um, her immigrant story okay. and so we're gonna, have this come to life for the children and for the community of Abilene. All right, Joyce, what do you got down there? Well, we have Just a Minute, a very popular book. Um, she did win an award here, and this is a counting book, uh, Just a Minute, and you'll be hearing the story of Grandma Beetle and Senor Calavera, and it's gonna be really fun and humorous, and we'll enjoy it. And Trish, what book do you have? Uh, Nino Wrestles the World, and Joyce is actually going to be able to bring authentic toys from Mexico. We're gonna have authentic Mexican candy. So it's kind of um, a travel through the different stages of life, not only um, from Juji's, Juji's perspective, but then also from a cultural perspective as well. So it's a real celebration of, of a life's journey. And so some of these books will be for sale at the Nickel? All of them will be for sale at the Nickel. All right. <laughs> and of course, it's free to get in. Yes. That's the great yes. part about all the donors that you have that help mm -hmm. you keep, keep alive. Art keep mm -hmm. art free. All right. Yes. Thank you, ladies, Thank for coming you. on. Trish, we love you. Love ladies, we love you. Thank if you. you would like to come out to the show, visit the Nickel this Thursday during Art Walk. There will be activities from 5 to 8 p.m.